In this video, we'll talk about the proper application of mini ties and a few tips to help along the way. First, always begin with a large size solid green suture. Using a smaller size could increase the chance of flossing through the contact point and reduce overall strength of construct. Use of the medium size should be limited to particularly tight embrasures where the large size won't fit. Begin the application of mini ties by inserting the blunt tip stainless steel introducer into the embrasure by either piercing the gingiva or displacing the papilla. After entering the maxillary embrasure from buccal to lingual, insert the introducer through the mandibular embrasure lingual to buccal. Insert the introducer into the green side of the clasp head to form a loop. Leave the ties loose until all are applied. Apply three to four ties on both the left and right sides of the mouth, ideally in sequential embrasures. This provides additional strength and minimizes the possibility of floss out while distributing the occlusive forces throughout the jaw. Begin tightening by moving the loop in a rocking motion to pull the suture through the gingival tissue until it is fully seated at the dental contact point. Tighten the sutures finger tight by pulling on the suture while pushing down on the clasp head until it is against the teeth. Once occlusion is confirmed, continue final tightening to ensure that there is no slack on the lingual side of the teeth. A short tail about an inch long can be left for intraoperative use, allowing for additional tightening if needed. Or, for closed treatment, cut the suture with a scalpel as close to the clasp head as possible so it is flush and smooth, maximizing patient comfort. You will not be able to tighten after this step. Please contact Invisian Medical for additional training and clinical materials.